Hey everybody, this is Cedar with Small Engine Velocity coming at you on a 44 degree day. Riding around in the sun after a weekend where it snowed in a lot of uh, Texas. I know it snowed in Bryan. I know it snowed in other remote parts of Texas. It did hail a little bit and it did uh, have a few flakes come from the sky, but in tradition, it never ever sticks to the ground. Anyways, I wanted to get out a little bit. I've been trapped in the house for a few days because of rain and then in the garage. So I wanted to kind of do the, the horn test and see what you guys think um, on it. I'm not gonna honk it now because I don't want to spoil anything, but I did honk on my wife on the way out. And she told me to be quiet because she didn't want me to piss off the neighbors. So that's a good sign, right? Like it's loud enough where your wife thinks you're gonna make neighbors mad and they're gonna call the police or something, thinking that someone pulled an 18 wheeler up in front of their house, which is illegal. Well, not legal. It's against, I guess, HOA or something like that. Which you're not allowed to do. Anyways, hope everyone's been doing good. I found, you know, I'm gonna go to my traditional spot for testing. I'm gonna go head over to Vintage Park. There's plenty of space out in the back where I can do my testing and uh, see what you guys think. Anyways, let's go ahead and get there so we can get this test started. But before that, let's go ahead and run the intro. All right, guys, here we are at Vintage Park. We're gonna drive through it a little bit, see if there's anyone we can honk at. See if they get any of their attention. No, no outliers of uh, early morning shopping. I guess 10.30 isn't really early morning, but I guess for being 44 degrees outside, I guess early morning isn't really right now, I guess. I don't know, we'll see. There's Texadelphia. It's basically Philadelphia or Philly Philly cheesesteak sandwiches with Texas flair. Interesting, right? Looks like there's a Scooby-Doo movie coming out. Here is the center. No one is here, which is good. We're not going to scare the crap out of people. <laughs> uh, I guess that's a good thing. I don't know if you guys remember this place, but I've done uh, motovlog rides and all sorts of other stuff from right here. So we're going to go ahead and this is how the test is going to be performed. I'm going to set up here this camera right here. I'm going to honk and we're going to record from both my helmet and here. I'm going to record from my helmet and here. I'll show you what it sounds like from the helmet and then how loud it is remote out here. Now keep in mind this doesn't have the best mic, but as long as you can hear it, you know, that's pretty good. So let me go ahead and get this set up real quick and I'll be right back. Clap, 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 clap. Synchronize the footage, la, la, la. All right, so now we got both the camera and the other camera, the one that's on my face, set up. So we're gonna go ahead and do a honk on each one of these little island pieces. There's four island pieces. So, near, far, far as the camera on the ground. Okay, so now we're going to go to the next one, to the same spot in the next aisle. So a full parking aisle over, near, far. Next. Three parking spots far away. I don't know if you can still see me, but I'm very tiny. Near. Far. One more. And this is about as far as I can get in the parking lot.
near, far. All right. I'd love to see what this feels like editing all the footage back together and see what it looks like. Now let's see if we can go find some unwilling victims to go ahead and honk at. I don't know how many people I'm going to find outside. Maybe I should do the honk test at people outside on the weekend. What do you think? Yeah, maybe I'll do it on the weekend. But what do you think? Here are my, here are my thoughts. Okay? Uh, since I haven't actually seen the footage or edited it or I don't know what it sounds like far away because I can't push the horn remotely. <laughs> hey, that'd be a cool idea. A remote horn button push. That'd be pretty cool. <laughs> if you see someone standing next to your ruckus, you could just like tap the button because it is directly hooked up to, it is directly hooked up to the battery. So... You know what? That makes me wonder. Does it honk when the bike is off? Alright, so the question is, will it honk when the butt car bike is off? So, the bike is off. Nope. Oh, it has to do with the relay, I bet. Okay, well. Alright. Well, that answers that question. I guess people can't honk my horn. While I'm not near the bike. Oh yeah, my thoughts. So, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be loud because there were people in the parking lot walking to their service vehicles. I guess there's some type of real estate place right there. They have a bunch of real estate cars to the right. I don't know if you saw them in the video, but I tried not to look at them to get them in the video. Uh, and they pretty much stopped and were staring at me like, what the heck is that guy doing? He crazy cray, he cray cray. Well, it was old people. So, they'd say something more like, That guy is suspicious. Golly gee williker. That sure is a loud horn. Anyways, <laughs> I think I'll call it quits for this video. Uh, I'm going to wait till the weekend to go and, and drive a ride around and honk at people. Because I think that will be super fun to do that. Because no one's out in the daytime on a weekday, on a work day. So, my assumption is uh, the weekend will be better. Maybe I'll find someone to ride with and we can do test humps at everybody. Anyways! Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see everybody in the next video.